if you are new here my name is josh i'm a youtuber i make youtube videos so basically okay so the dark sides of the body game were like basically like downsides of the body game like things that you may have to deal with or things that are like off like sometimes is a problem is that when you're dealing with body game one thing you have to constantly deal with and this is goes from like workplaces goes for like relationships friendships and everything like that is an intimidation factor that you cannot control it's like more so intimidation factor of like someone may be insecure or someone you're dealing with somebody's insecurity so for an example of this you are just starting to get into the gym right so you're not in the beginner stages anymore like you've been going you know what I'm saying you've been putting that work in and your body starts to change that's what people don't talk about people talk about getting into the gym but when your body starts to change especially when people seen how your body was previously let's say six months ago they see your body you were just starting you know everybody's like, oh yeah i'm gonna start, I'm, a, I'm gonna go to the gym really doing it and now your body's changing so the dark side is about that is you're going to start to realize that people are going to realize that your body is different is more aesthetic is more aesthetically pleasing to the eye and you are changing the, 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 the you are changing the dynamics in every situation that you're in so instead of you being the big friend or the fat friend you are not a swole friend or instead of being the the uh the cute friend or whatever like that now you're the cute and perfect body friend so it's like sometimes people want you to be at a certain level like they don't want to feel left out or they don't feel like somebody's like doing better than them so basically it's like now you understand that what comes with it is that you have to keep working out so it's like when you're working out you're able to figure out like okay now I'm changing the dynamic. This person is probably going to treat me differently. This person now sees me as more of a threat because now you have more options to women and you have more options to different opportunities now because people are like comment complimenting you like, oh, yeah, your body does look good. Or like, hey, like that shirt is fitting you nicely and everything like that. And it's like sometimes I can mess up your mental because it can get you off your get off track. Sometimes if you let it get to you because people will literally comment or interrupt you going to the gym like instead of you you know what i'm saying you have a schedule you this time you go to the gym you may notice like you may get a call you may get a text and it's just like to kind of rock you off your your seesaw you know what i'm saying or it's just like it's just gonna cause you to disrupt you because sometimes people don't like for them to not be the shiniest object in a room or like sometimes people don't like understand like when you are working out they don't want somebody who is stronger than them or they want to be the strongest one in the room next thing i want to talk about is you may get promoted this is a big one or it's a downside about a game especially if i feel like somebody finds you attractive or whatever like that or your boss whatever it called finds you attractive or your boss is trying to talk to you mind you i live in atlanta that happens all the time so everyone's like oh my god how this person makes a lot of money sometimes they boss is trying to get at them and they want to do any they'll do anything to promote this person because they find them attractive but basically is that you may get promoted before somebody and you may not deserve the promotion you may not deserve the position you've been promoted to and i've seen this happen for women i've seen this happen for men but people choose a lot of times based on bodies if they feel like listen if they feel like you you that guy or you that girl they will promote and not think twice and the other person wasn't even in the running the other person didn't even have a chance like that's just how powerful body game is that's what you guys understand is that you can get you can make this thing about this is your life so this is a lifestyle this can change your lifestyle somebody will promote you solely on your body is a steady your is body game and it's on a subconscious level that's what rom will shout rom will she always says it's like it's a subconscious level we're human beings at the end of the day big thing like you feel guilty that you've been granted these opportunities and it's just basically solely off of how you how your body is you know what i mean or how good your body is or how strong you are so that's definitely important that happens all the time i, I see it happen all the time and a lot of people are confused a lot of people do know what's going on and it, it is angering so just keep that in mind guys like really understand that uh next thing i would say is that you will get a lot you will get a lot a lot a lot a lot a lot of uh negative attention negative attention being like envy and stuff like that like um in the gym if you start continuously going to the gym right and you start getting progress but you get to a point where 
your body is just every day. It's just, this is just new you. This body, this new body that you have is just what's going to happen. This is just how you're going to be. It's from your mindset and from your workout lifestyle, your body is just going to be top tier forever because you just mentally, you're going to be able to go to the gym. We're going to die. This is going to be second nature to you. So once you switch to that lifestyle, you will start to understand that like people are either motivated by you or they're fueled by envy by you. Like in the sense of like, they may feel like, they may see you like, man, they may see your post like, man, I want my body to look like that. And it's not like an admiration, it's more so like, why is it like, I, I, I don't like that. You get, people can see your physique, it, it shows through shirts, it's obvious people like you as a human like you're gonna be walking the day that you can see these things like you're not going around you're not driving with your eyes closed you're not shopping with your eyes closed you're not going your day-to-day -day life with your eyes closed you know what i mean like when you go to the gym your eyes aren't closed so it is people will compare themselves to you comparison is a thief of all joy and guess who stole the joy you because someone is comparing themselves to you whether if you can eat what you want right or dieting is just so easy you make it look effortless or you're starting to you know really really get stronger you can fight everybody you know what i'm saying somebody will probably have to defend yourself you're more of a masculine figure and people will compare themselves are comparing themselves to you physically whether if you have a six-pack their goal now may be to get a six-pack whether if you have big biceps big legs big arms big traps like you then people visualize how you are mentally and mind you you not you have no idea that this mental picture that they have of you is in their head but they will constantly compare themselves to you who just existing or presenting yourself can anger that person because they're seeing what they're lacking they're seeing what they don't have it's almost like if somebody has a nicer car than you and you see the model that you should have got or the one that you couldn't afford or you start Think about decisions that you made in your life and why you're not able to do a certain thing yeah that becomes you so you as a person being in body game people have a mental picture of you and they see or they're able to see you on a day-to-day -day basis and see like okay i'm not working out or every time they're eating a meal they're counting like okay well i don't really want to eat because i feel fat you know what i'm saying they're comparing themselves to you and it's not how it should be but with body game you do bring out a lot of like envy insecurities and everything like that so you have to be careful and it, it really helps you to not be boastful you know what i mean like you can be muscular all that but humble humility will keep you alive you know what i'm saying just like it won't ruin any opportunities you won't rub me by the wrong way further than what you already have and you got to keep a level head you know what i'm saying because this is a blessing and fitness as a as a fitness influencer or a youtuber going into the fitness fit you get a lot of eyes with the fitness like it's it's a lot more of attention like so um but yeah that's the end of the video hope you like the video uh you do guys you guys do like these uh body game videos i will give y'all some more y'all been liking make sure you like the video if you like them like them so that way i know i can post more of them and you know what i'm saying we both have a conversation because like the more likes i get or the more uh i figure out y'all like them the more we can have these conversations and we can talk about it but yeah if you like the video make sure you like the video any questions leave them down below and subscribe to my channel and i'll be back with another video thanks so much for watching I'm out. <laughs>